video for you today. I'm actually going to be breaking it up into two parts. This is the first part, which is going to be all the fashion related stuff, and then the second haul, uh, or second part of the haul is going to be like the beauty stuff. I did place um, a couple online orders, and yeah. So, let's get started with this stuff. So I did make my first ever Zara purchase, and I've been in the store several times, but it's pretty pricey, most of the stuff anyway. There are some affordable things, but I just never really found anything that I really felt like shelling out the money for. Um, so this time when I saw this t-shirt, it was 20 bucks. I know 20 bucks for a t-shirt is, is debatable for me, but I really liked what it said on it because it kind of pertains to everything social media, um, which is kind of all that I really do here. It's a white t-shirt, and it has a picture of a girl on it, which is kind of creepy, but it's the words that are like over her face that are kind of cool. So it says like, and post, and comment, and share, and tag, and publish, and link, and visit, and subscribe, and follow, and link, and love. So I don't know why it says link twice. But, um, I just really liked it. I just thought it was kind of funny because it's literally things that I do on a daily basis over and over again. Um, and I don't know, I just thought it was kind of cool. So that was my first Zara purchase. I'm very pleased with it. Well, I haven't worn it yet, but I, I assume I will be. Okay. Next on to Urban Outfitters, they were having their extra half off all their clearing stuff. They're clearing out stuff for the new fall and winter season, so I figured I would check it out and see if there's anything worth it. Even their like regular clearance prices I don't feel like are very good, so when they have the like extra half off, it's like, heck yeah, I'm going to try it out. So I did pick up a couple things. The first thing, if you follow me on Instagram, you've already probably seen it, but it is a romper... I guess you could say, and it has like these really thin um, like rope sort of string straps, and it's a size medium, which is why it's a bit large on me, but it has a really deep cut neckline. It's very, very thin. This is the type of thing that I would probably wear um, like under a thin sweater or as a bathing suit cover up or something like that. It has a drawstring waist which is the only reason I can really wear it. If it did, it would just be way too billowy and baggy and unshapely on me. So that was that and it was originally $59. It was on sale for $30 and I got half off that so it was only $15. So I thought that was um, fairly reasonable so I picked that up. Now I was actually on the fence about that romper because it was a medium and it didn't fit me exactly perfectly, but then I saw this sweater and I grabbed it and I threw it over that romper and I really liked how that looked. So it's, this again is like a very thin sweater as I was talking about. It's got a lot of, um, like, not holes, but it's very thin and see-through. So this is the type of thing that I would throw on over that romper and it's just kind of like this loose, comfortable, billowy kind of outfit. Um, for fall, you could throw on like some tights and some socks over it, or in addition to it, to make it a little bit more fall appropriate um, here in SoCal anyway. So this is actually a size large, but it's really, really soft, and I like big sweaters anyway. This was originally $59 as well, then again down to $29.99. Same pricing, and it was uh, half off that, so I got those two things. Lastly, for that particular shopping trip, I went to Forever 21 specifically looking for gold rings, and I did manage to find a set, and I also found a necklace that I am slightly obsessed with. So I'm actually wearing part of the ring set right now. It has a tiger's eye ring, it has a faux turquoise one, and then just a random black stone. So those are three of them. The other three rings in the set are all the same. They're just like this basic band with some kind of... I don't want to call them stripes, but they're just like these series of bands around it, I guess. Um, this set was $4.90, which I thought was actually really good for six rings, so there's that. And the other piece I got, I'm so excited. So if you guys follow me again on Instagram, you've probably seen my uh, silver coin necklace, and I talked about it in my last haul video, I believe. Um, well, I was at Forever 21, and I found the gold version of it, and it was the only one that they had, and I was like, you know what, I don't want to do the same thing again where I pass it up and regret it forever, <laughs> and so um, I just bought it on a whim. I haven't worn this one yet, but I do really like the antique burnished gold more so than like the really high polished type of gold, so uh, I think it's going to be so good for fall, so... Yay! This was $14.90, by the way. 
Alright, so the next thing I got is actually a new purse, and the reason that I was looking for one is because my old one, my cotton on one, is black, and I've worn it in several off the days and stuff. Um, it's starting to wear, like, the faux leather stuff is starting to, like, crack and peel, which is gross and just looks really bad. So I decided to pick up a new purse. I went to DSW with my mom, actually, last weekend, or maybe the weekend before that, when I was at home, but um, they had this purse there. It looks very, I think this is, like, the... What was it? Alexander Wang for Target collection? I think this is fairly similar to it if my memory uh, is correct. But <laughs> this one was $20 because it was an additional, I think, like 40% off the sale price. And the sale price is like $35 or something. Anyway, um, I got a good deal. It was only $20. I really like it. It's big enough to fit everything that I need, but it's small enough that it's not too heavy, it's not too bulky, and this color is very good for fall. Um, so, yeah. Alright, and lastly I have a package from Windsor. I did open it already because I was really, really okay. I was just too excited to get this stuff. Like, I was picking out something like, this is going to be such a good outfit. And normally I don't even pick stuff out that would, like, be an outfit, and I actually didn't do that intentionally here either. But you can wear all of it together, and it's just like, you know, when you just put together a look, and it's like, this, this is a good, this is good. This solid right here. So anyway, um, I'm just really <laughs> super happy with everything that I picked out and I'm uh, just so happy to work with Windsor. You guys are lovely, lovely people. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Alright, so the first thing I got is a pair of booties, and I'm sure you guys have seen styles like this before. It's got lace-up, it kind of has this, uh, like, fold, I don't know what that would be called, but it has, like, a hidden wedge, and that is what those look like. I got a size six and a half. They fit me perfectly, and I love them. Now, the reason I wanted to get some sort of black booty in particular is because whenever I wear, like, knee-high black socks or anything like that, I feel like when I wear chunkier black boots or just the ones that I have, it doesn't look quite right. So I wanted to get something like that to elongate the legs and just kind of blend in more, if that makes any sense. Um, and I got these tights. It kind of goes along with that whole concept. So these are like faux garter looking tights. So it, it has, I don't know, I'll do a close up so you guys can see, but it has like a faux garter looking pattern to it. So. These are the kind of thing that I would wear with those booties, so I got those. Super stoked. So the next thing, uh, you guys know how much I love plaid and flannel, preferably together, um, but this is like an oversized plaid flannel tunic, which is like the greatest invention ever. So it's just um, like a red, black, and navy type of plaid, and it's oversized, and it's super comfy and soft, and I love it so much. Since I'm short, I can get away with wearing it as a dress because it is oversized. I feel like depending on how tall you are, it could look a little bit scandalous, but on me I think it looks pretty normal. Um, I got it in a size small, this was $36.90, and I just love it so much. So good for fall. Frankly, it's good for any season in my opinion, but particularly good for fall. Alright, and the last thing I know is going to screw up my lighting because it is a white t-shirt dress and I wasn't expecting this to be so, like, high quality. <laughs> it sounds kind of weird, but it's like thicker than a regular t-shirt. Okay, whatever, you know, I'm just going to, there we go. So it's just a basic t-shirt dress, but it is um, a bit more substantial. It feels a little bit thicker. It's not your basic, just typical cotton t-shirt material, which I like. Um, this is a size medium, and it, it was $24.90, but I just love all this stuff so much. I'm so excited. Alright, that about wraps it up, I believe. I think I got everything. So, thank you guys for watching, and stay tuned for part two. I'm not filming that part today, because I still have to get the packages um, of some of the beauty stuff. So that'll be coming up hopefully uh, shortly, but there are no guarantees. So I'll see you guys next time. Again, thank you for watching. Bye!